Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to my channel. Eat healthy, get rich, drink good beer. If you don't know me, my name is Taranjit Singh Rai, and this video is totally for entertainment purposes. Today, we're gonna look into Neo from the lens of hike and ashy candles. Also, today, I'm gonna show you how to make a simple, nutritious meal, something that can be used as breakfast, lunch, or dinner. So let's get started. For this dish, you need finely chopped cucumber, red onions, grated, red Leicester, green chilies. If you put jalapenos, then that becomes a Mexican dish. If you put green chilies, that becomes a Punjabi dish. If any Mexican is watching this, I apologize from bottom of my heart for this food blasphemy. And if a Punjabi is watching this, consider this as marriage of two cultures. You also need grated mild cheddar, a large whisked egg. I've only added dried parsley in it. There is no need to add salt because the salt will come from cheese and the chicken. Next is chopped tomatoes. This is sweet chili chicken left over from last night. Last thing is this is a wheat tortilla. You can use a maize tortilla. And if some Indians are watching, you can use rotis as well. Guys, this is such a versatile dish. If you add crispy bacon, that becomes your breakfast. If you add chicken, could be lunch or dinner. You can also add beef. And to down this spicy mix, beer of the day is vocation. It's citrusy, it's hazy, it's really, really tasty. And this is brewed in England, somewhere between Manchester and Leeds. So cheers. Wow. So I've just lightly added some butter to the pan, throw in the eggs. In goes the red Leicester. Be generous, guys. And this cheese will help this tortilla to bind it. In goes tortilla. Be careful with your hands. Flip it over. Woohoo! And now, guys, it's up to the filling. Again, I'm gonna go with cheese. This is what kids love. Little bit of red onion, guys. Less is more here. So don't be greedy to add a lot. Little bit of cucumber. And the Punjabi thing, we will have the green chilies. And the last ingredient is the chicken. Fold it over. Gently press. Cut it in three pieces. And that there is Punjabi diya. And I'm gonna try it. Try this recipe guys. And let's move on to the stocks. Now you have learned how to cook. Punjabi Diya. Let's move on to the next aspect, which is looking at some of these stocks through the lens of Hike and Ashy Candles. I made this video last week and I got a lot of love. Let's just revise what it is. Again, I don't want to go into mathematics of it. It is pretty easy to do. You can do daily, you can do weekly, you can do monthly. My preference is weekly because I think there is a price to be paid for confirming whether it's an uptrend or whether a stock has a downtrend this kind of analysis is applicable to not only crypto but also to the traditional stock markets i am not a big believer of trading analysis however because i'm a long-term investor i would love to know when i should be dollar cost averaging into an asset and when i should be dollar cost averaging out of the asset so according to hike and ashy candles uptrend are characterized by large candle bodies long upper shadows or wicks and no lower shadows downtrends are characterized by large candle bodies no upper wicks or minimal upper wicks or no upper shadows and long lower wicks or long lower shadows i'm not gonna talk about the new cars they are releasing i'm not gonna talk about how they are utilizing battery as a service i'm not gonna talk about that blackrock and jp morgan have increased their stake in neo i'm not gonna talk about that neo as far as my understanding is concerned is not a car company the electric vehicle is one of the products it's an e-commerce company it's a software company i'm not gonna talk about that neo is about to massively expand in europe i'm not gonna talk about the fact that neo might also be listed in chinese stock market there is a massive amount of investors in the chinese stock market and the reason for the current volatility is combination of many factors number one is hyper inflation number two russia is at the border of ukraine this is a crisis that has been created 
according to me i might be wrong buy the vest the moment i go to grocery store to buy i can see the price has risen for a single person earning i have really started to feel the punch the electricity prices have tripled gas prices have tripled inflation is 7.5 percent so the media narrative is for you to focus on ukraine for you to get angry that russia is about to invade ukraine for you to forget how rubbish the governments are doing because they have been printing money like crazy but anyways as it's up to you to act intelligently and make your decisions so as i said there is a cost to be paid to confirm a trend for example in this rally up you can see there is literally no lower wicks and the price almost reached 66 but then you can see that these this price was slightly coming down and this red candle here and this red candle here was my confirmation guys i did sell around these prices i was in neo very long time ago i sold it many times acting conservatively is the best thing don't go into this diamond hands bs you're on your own in stock market and you should always try to protect your investments i'm not a financial advisor these videos are totally for entertainment purposes nobody nobody sells at the top okay nobody perfectly buys the bottom i was very tempted to sell i became greedy but because Heiken Ashi candles can actually tell you the trend like even if you sold here that's still 57 pounds but once this trend was confirmed even here it's 48 pounds if someone has bought around six dollars seven dollars ten dollars fifteen dollars twenty four dollars this price is nothing as compared to the profits that you can lock in okay so similarly this downtrend you can start to see these weekly green candles here again there was a little bit of downtrend but once again if you have no lower shadows here again that's your indication that it is in an uptrend and now if you look very carefully here there is this small green candle and the size of these candle bodies is decreasing and decreasing and decreasing i think the bottom is 19 dollars and you can see that this is the same price which was in september 2021 it is a big area of support so i think between 19 to 24 dollars is a really good accumulation stage you are long term into neo this is your opportunity to dca again not financial advice now you can say that okay taranjit neo is a very very new company maybe this is a fluke maybe what you're telling is is only applicable to neo so let's let's pick two popular stocks let's pick apple first okay so let's let's see so apple's institutional ownership is 58 percent there is a reason why institutes keep buying into apple again and again and again again this is uptrend large candle bodies long upper shadows no lower shadows large candle bodies you you, you get the point every single uptrend here here's another one and again you can know the sideways action you can know the uptrend and you can know the right downtrend there is a tiny price to be paid to confirm this high ashi candles have stood the test of time so you can easily see around these levels 61 62 dollars right up to here you could have actually doubled your money confirmed the trend so if there is a price to be paid when the downtrend starts there is also a price to pay when to buy when an uptrend starts let's have a quick look at tesla and again what do you see you can see that these large candle bodies again you you know the story now yeah you can pick any uptrend in tesla any downtrend in tesla and the hike and ashy candles will always stand the test of the time it is mainly because it's a lagging indicator but this is something you can use as a long-term investor to increase the number of tesla stocks you have increase the number of apples increase the number of neos i am extremely bullish on neo electric vehicles are the future this is close to the bottom as per hike and ashy candles and in my personal opinion this is the place where i will start to dca in now guys i am also very very curious to listen to your thoughts all you need to do to play with so this is a trading view this is a free software you can download all i have done is i have hit these candles here and just selected haikanashi you can also do weekly you can do monthly 
If you are a paid member, you can do two weekly as well. But there's really interesting patterns to be seen when you apply this technique. That's all I have to say in this video. If you like the content, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification button. I'm only your weekend YouTuber. YouTube algorithm doesn't like me. So smash that like button and I'll see you in the next video.